Yo, what's going on, everybody, man? It's your boy, Marcus Elbow. Welcome to Elbow Media Studios. And if this is your first time, I would advise you to go ahead and hit that subscription button and hit that notification bell because you don't want to miss tutorials like this because all we do over here is keep it crunk, man. Let's get it. Elbow Media Studio. All right, guys. So. In the last tutorial we did, uh, we did on just the basics on getting started. I just want to get you started, get you to doing some beats and, and just get you up and going. Because I know you just bought the machine, you were excited, you wanted to do a track. That's what that whole tutorial was about. So what we're going to do is we're going to continue on going down that um, that road of getting started. Now that you already have created your track, and as you can see here, I already have my track created. As you can see it lined up here and I used eight tracks. What I'm gonna show you how to do now is to break your beat down inside of the matrix so that you can set it up so we can go into our next tutorial, which is gonna be the arranger, okay? All right, so let's go ahead on and see what it's gonna take for us to be able to do that. Okay, so there's a few different ways you can do this. On track one here, on lane one, track one, uh, you can actually hold down copy, hit the, hit the first track, and then hit the second one. And you can actually go through and copy each one that way. But there's a quicker way to do that. If you want to delete that clip, all you have to do is hold down delete and hit that clip. Okay. Now, I want to go ahead and copy all of the tracks. And then I'll start deleting them as I go. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hold down copy again. And then I'm going to hit the lunch for that first lane. And then I'm going to hit the second one. I'm going to hit it again and hit the next one hit it again and hit the next one and now I have four essentially breakdowns for this beat already so let's go ahead and hear the beat real quick I'll turn it down a little bit there we go all right so if you watch our streams you'll know that uh, I played that beat on last week's stream okay so now that I know that that beat is there I have four different breakdowns for that I can start breaking the track down any way I want right now so what I could do is I can just start deleting things I can go ahead and delete uh, let's see what I can do is I, I can actually listen to it and delete it while I'm doing it we can go to the mixer I can push play turn it down a little bit I know my kit my kicks are right here because I can see them here at the top so I can just start deleting Let's go ahead and get that clap out of there. And if we wanted to, we can start our track off that way. Right? Actually, we can delete this last part back here. And if we wanted to, I think I want the uh, this one right here to come back, which is track four. Let's go ahead and push copy on track four. And then we'll go ahead and just put that right here let's go ahead and launch it again I think I kind of like it starting like that let me hear this other track though I'm going to copy this one and bring it up I'm going to launch again I kind of like that. Okay, so now, let me go ahead and stop that. So now that I know that that right there, those four tracks are what I'm going to use at lunch. Now when I come down to the next one, I can actually leave this one full because I can just actually just lunch it the way it is because I want the whole beat to come in, right? Or I could just take out this part right here. Let's just go ahead and hit delete and remove that and then have that part of the beat just drop in right there. Let's try it. If I go to the matrix, we can see exactly when we're going to drop it. Now, what 
what I want to happen is what I want I want to happen is when I get ready to head down to this next line, I want a few things to drop out. I definitely want the lead to drop out. So I'm gonna go ahead on and hold down the lead and I'm gonna hit the lead here on my lane three. I want that to be gone. And let's see what else I want. I'll start from there from right now. And I want the hay to come out as well. So we're gonna take the hay out as well. And let's go ahead and launch it. Let's go to the uh, matrix. See what we're doing, we're just, we're just building our track. We're building our hooks, we're building our verses. All of that right here in the matrix. This is what's so cool about the fours. It teaches you to work in a different type of way, right? So that's pretty cool. Now, if we wanted to, whenever we get ready to go back down here, we can break it down even more and take the bass out. So let's take a look at that. We can take the bass out. We can leave the hay in. Um, we'll take out the lead as well. And then let's see how that sounds coming in. breaking it all the way down. I like that. Let's break it back down. Now, what's really cool about the force that I think some people don't even realize, and if they don't or if they do, I'm definitely going to let you guys know, you don't have to launch those clips the way I just did it. You can actually launch clips by themselves. Just that easy. I just wanted to show you guys that you can actually go in and break your stuff down real quick. This was a quick tutorial on how to do your beat downs and your breaks in the lunch section of the Akai force man i hope you enjoyed this we're gonna move on to the arranger in the next tutorial i see you guys in a hot minute all right don't forget hit that sub hit that subscription button hit that notification bell hit that like button if you like this video all right all right man i'll catch up with y'all later one peace